What is up everyone, Knows Infinity here, back at it again with a game called The Day Before. The Day Before offers players a unique, reimagined journey into the post-apocalyptic open-world MMO survival set in the present day on the east U.S. coast following a deadly pandemic. The game literally just launched, so let's get in and see what we can do here. So it looks like you can come in here and choose your personality, general settings, skin, makeup, hair. So we're gonna go ahead and see here what uh, we want. You got roamers. You got a pathfinder, ghost, all right. Before the apocalypse, your life was a tough struggle, survival, just as it is now. You have impressive character passion, quick tempered, although you're not inclined to hold grudges for long in the past. You were a roamer and a drunkard, but with the onset of the apocalypse, you set a goal to change your life for the better. At a Pathfinder, before the apocalypse, you led a typical life worked a regular job, you were known for the kindness and fairness, processing intelligence and hidden leadership qualities, you adhere to moral principles, however there is a dark side to you, your determination and thirst for power can make you act deceivingly and uncompromisingly even against your own convictions. Alright, so that's Pathfinder. We got Ghost. Before the apocalypse, the details of your life remained a mystery, hidden from the eyes of those around you. Your character is complex, but harmonious. It combines toughness and ruthlessness with a deep-seated sense of justice and kindness. You've always been a skeptical of authority and laws, and now that the apocalypse has changed the world, you relish the opportunity to act in accordance with your convictions in the new in this new order. Uh, let's try this. What is this? Okay, so traits: stamina skills increased by one level. Tenacious: the injury resistance skills increased by one level. Train: the automatic rifle reload speed skills increased by one level. All right, Pathfinder has charismatic. The trading skill is increased by one level. Resourceful, resourceful. The healing skill is increased by one level. Cold blooded. The sniper rifle reload skill is increased by one level. If you go with Roamer, you get enduring. The weight capacity is increased by one level. Reception looting skill is increased by one level. Hardened. The automatic rifle recoil control skill is re is increased by one level. Okay. I don't want to go with this, to be honest. Try some, uh, create a character. So we got that class. Over here, see what we got, some options here. Skin tone, we can choose all different skin tones here, not too shabby. Eye color. Oh, that's freaking dope. That looks badass. Looks sick. Alright, body type A. You can go B. I usually pick a uh, chick, to be honest, so. But, uh, I'll probably go, like, guy and stuff, so. Is 
Oh, this guy, general. Alright. Eye color. Go back to that wicked looking one. Alright, first rule is cardio. Now I get it. Alright, the first rule is cardio. Now I get it. Okay. Alright, the first rule is cardio. 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 Now, alright, the first rule is cardio. Now, well, uh, skin. I have scars here. Hey, that's pretty sick, though. A lot of, a lot of character customization here. Feel like that age. The older, younger. Stick to the young side. Tattoos, but none. Oh, angel, huh? This looks pretty badass. I, I like this one. Tattoo depth. Go back a little bit, make it look like you've had them for a while, you know. You can choose the color of your tattoos. That's pretty sick. What does this do? Nothing? Or does that scroll it down? Maybe? I don't know. Makeup. Use some face stuff here. I'm too shabby. Okay. Oh, okay, let's see. There's like a whole list. Nice, alright. Uh, lips colored dead. We'll just leave all that. Hair. Go up here, you got this. Boom, boom. That's some pretty, uh, pretty good selection of hairstyles and stuff here. Pretty badass. Like something like that would be pretty badass. Use all these different colors. I'll go like that. y'all have ever seen me in real life this is probably closest to what I look like here if I shave the sideburns and it's like this it's so funny that's pretty badass though fuck I don't know what I want to go with this is kind of similar to that and then it grows out <laughs> to this All right, y'all, I think we're gonna go with this. We've been in the apocalypse, right? So our hair is growing longer and all that good jazz. Yeah, I think we're gonna go like this. You can choose the uh, different beard colors too. There you go, make it all light, like the rest of it. There we go. Hell yeah. Select a server. How many people are on these? Damn, bro. Everybody's on them. Havenport. Let's go Havenport. <laughs> Let's just try to get into one. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking every server is full. 
Black the server. What up? It just launched. Huh? It just launched, so yeah. Yeah, I know. C cliff or sec cliff. C cliff. Come on, baby. Let me join. Uh, North America. Damn you. Oh, tell me I get in. Please. No. Damn, they're gonna have to get some more servers, man. Everybody probably just said, fuck the character creation, just get in the game. Oh, we got a lot of, a lot of them here. Come on, baby. Get us in one. You can't, you can't scroll this down is the thing. Wolfridge. Fingers crossed. Bro. Greenland. <laughs> oh, there's so many people on right now. This is crazy. Golden Rook, I think. West Cliff. I'll sit here until we get in one. I don't really think about that. Juniper. Red Ridge. Wonder if people are just sitting here like this, just hitting these until they can get in. Alright, but that's what they're doing. Right, let's go maple wood. It's going to take forever. The European servers looking like. Damn. Asia servers low. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. 
ping would be horrible though on those. Dude, that's crazy how many freaking people have already filled it up. All full. I'll just keep hitting this one. Which this is probably what people are doing. Unless they're just sitting down here for it to like refresh or something. They won't, they didn't say how many uh, people were on the servers, like capable of getting on servers, so we don't even know what the server count is. It could be 60, it could be 30, you know? Oh, this is low. I did a refresh. Now. Oh, oh, I think we're getting in. I don't give a shit what server. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, baby. Talk. I to see what it looks like. Yeah, yeah. Well, when I go to post this, I'll be, uh, I'll clip all the fucking long ass wait out. I mean, it's not that long, so I guess, you know. People could skip forward, I guess. Be a lamp for yourselves, be your own refuge. Seek for no other. All things must pass. Strive on diligently. Yeah, I'm excited. I wasn't able to adjust volumes or nothing, so I don't know. Maybe in game. How are you feeling? When we found you, you had lost a lot of blood. I don't usually believe in miracles, so I assume that your quick recovery is the result of. I just hope it stays smoother because I can't adjust graphic settings yet. Welcome to Woodbury. I think this is the first time we've ever seen you here. 
So you're probably not from around these parts. But don't worry. Make yourself at home. So, can you get up? Try to get off the bed. Alright, y'all. If we can adjust settings and need to, we'll do our best here. First chance to adjust anything here. Uh, F, hold F to interact. Great. I'm really glad to see you recovering so quickly. We've saved people from the outside before, but we practically pulled you back from the brink of death. Oh, well, thank you. My name is Wayne, Woodbury's doctor. And you are? I'm Nils Infinity, bro. All right. Your speech organs seem fine. Nice to meet you. Well, I'm sure you have a lot of questions. But our leader, Chris, will fill you in on everything better than I can. So, if you're feeling okay already, you can grab your bag and go take a look around. Hell yeah. Everyone in Woodbury already knows we have a newcomer. We found you not far from Woodbury. Bleeding and now unconscious. Your car was nearby, overturned. And it looked like you'd been fighting with a large group of infected. It's a good thing we found you in time. Oh, yeah. Anything else? I'm sure Chris will tell you more than I can. Take care. And get well soon. <coughs> After you get to Chris, you can always find me at the infirmary. All right, nice. Don't forget to take your belongings. They're in the bag by the door. Oh, yeah. So you just right click and all goes right into my inventory. Very nice. I like that. For weapons and other equipment, oh, yeah. So you got backpack, equipment, case, weapons, got health, hunger, thirst. Right click to use this. Nice, nice. Can't pick that up now. What else? All right. Oh, okay. I was letting go too soon. Oh snap! Those must be other other people running around that I see. <laughs> it is. We see other players all all in the background. Those are all players because you'll see multiple, and it's because they're all standing there talking. Mm -hmm. That's so funny. Nice, nice. Increase your stamina, all right, cool, cool. Fast earn money and reputation points. All right, all right. Nice. And run around, take a look here at all the stuff in here. Looks so good. And looks really good. A bar here. Nice. Damn. This is so smooth, it's crazy. Nice. Hell yeah. Dr. Chris. 
Hello, you're the survivor we rescued a couple of days ago, aren't you? We were all praying for your speedy recovery. It's good to see you're okay. Thank you for saving me. We always tried to help those in trouble. Otherwise, where would we be if we didn't show humanity to each other? Definitely not here. My name is Chris, and I'm in charge of this shelter called Woodbury. Here, we have gathered all the remaining survivors from New Fortune City and the surrounding suburbs. In Woodbury, we all work together towards rebuilding our society, and any help would be greatly appreciated. Each of us would like to live in a better world. A world where our children can play freely on the streets, where we won't have to live every day in uncertainty and fear of death. This dream is what unites all of us. Get to know the members of our close-knit team to see how everything is organized here. Talk to the weapons trader, Eddie, the storage keeper, Abby, the bartender, Ron, and Dr. Leonard. After you're done talking, come back to me, and in the meantime, I'll register you. Hell yeah. Get all this stuff done. Ah, fucking chat. Oh shit, I gotta go in here. I know what it's like to take on the biggest scar scratched by an infected. Greetings, buddy. I see you finally recovered. Let me introduce myself. I'm Edward, the weapon. Edward. It was my guys who found you almost dead out there. We Thanks. Don't leave people in distress here in Woodbury. Quite the opposite, actually. Here, I've got something for you. Gun. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is the Moloch Hunter, an excellent rifle. Just needs to be assembled at the workbench. Once you assemble it, you can have it for yourself. It's a gift. Boys. Nice. You'll have a better chance of making it back home on your own two feet. Rather than on a stretcher like last time. Oh yeah. You need to thank you. The important thing is that you're alive. The rest doesn't matter. Well, I wish you luck, buddy. If you ever want to buy top-notch weapons and ammunition, or if you want to sell anything you don't need, feel free to come to me. Sounds good. Until we meet again. All right. Here in the workshop. All right. I select weapon. Manage attachments. Cover. Okay. Go back. Manage that. Handguard. All right. And uh, tactical grip. Oh, workbench. All right, nice, nice. Hell yeah. All right, where do I gotta go now? Okay, over here. Oh yeah. Hey there. You're the survivor everyone's been talking about lately, right? Glad to see you're okay. I'm Abby, the storage room keeper. It's the safest place in Woodbury, so people use it to store their personal belongings. I can see your backpack is pretty full. Leave the things you don't need right now with me. It'll make it easier for you to move around. Don't worry. They'll be perfectly safe here. Okay, so we store some You're stuff here. Use it. Energy drink. Got ammo. Got key in the food. Right here, you got your energy, health, thirst. All right. Great. That's the way to go. The storage room is available completely free of charge for all Woodbury residents. Chris registered you, didn't he? Please talk to him if he hasn't yet, all right? Meanwhile, I'll keep an eye on your things. Oh, yeah. Pretty cool that we got, like, a little central storage area. Fatal injury, open world. You lose all items in your backpack. For any lost items, save them in storage. Place items in your protected case, but it has its capacity is limited. Okay, nice. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, we gotta go that way. Alright, let's go down this hall. Remember, zombies go down fast. Get over here and talk to everybody real quick. Wishing you a good day. Chris, once you do register as a resident of Woodbury, that's great. We always welcome new members to our community. Just yesterday, we were oh, yeah. sure that you would be okay. Well, in that case, I need to give you this. Oh, nice TPS shows all points of interest, recreation routes on a map, New Fortune State. You can also use it to see and accept community tasks that people would be giving you. Nice. It's a GPS map of New Fortune City and its surrounding area. It marks all the evacuation points through which you can safely return to Woodbury. Keep an eye on the map. The closer you are to an evacuation point, the safer it will be. All right, all right. According to the rules, I need to wait for confirmation from Chris that you're a registered resident. Once you're done with that, feel free to drop by if you need any meditation. Oh, yeah. All right, then. See you later. Take care of your health. Alright, talk to you later, buddy. For medication anytime. Be careful Can outside. And they put so much detail into this, it's freaking crazy how good it looks. You go in the bar now. I know they're doing this just so you get familiar with all the different people. So, how are you doing? Enjoying your time here, huh? Actually, Chris warned me that he'd be sending you my way to get to know each other. So, I've prepared a little gift for you. I'm sure it'll come in handy. Oh, medications. Restore health, stop bleeding, heal injured body parts. The larger the size of the first aid kit, the more time it can be used. Nice. I kept this first aid kit for myself, but uh, I haven't been out in a while. And I like you, so take it. <laughs> Maybe it'll save your life again someday. So, did Chris get you registered already? When you're done, swing That's by okay. here. We'll I always have good food, food drinks, and supplies in case you're heading out. Oh, yeah. Catch up again, pal. They see you rolling, they hate. Ah, shit. Here we go again. Have a great day. Ah, you can just hear them talking and shit, and it's funny. Turn to Chris. Oh, okay, so they're actually leading you around in the direction you gotta go. That's cool. Go, oh, Chris. Look at all these people here. All the different people here. It's so funny. Great. I see you've met everybody. So, what do you think of Woodbury at first glance? I like it. It's good to hear that. It took a lot of effort to make Woodbury what it is. I hope our community lives up to your expectations. I'm confident that you'll find something to keep you occupied here. I'm ready to tell you more whenever you want. So, now I'll inform the team that you're a registered resident, and from this moment on, all the services provided by Woodbury will be at your disposal. Oh yeah. I have to live here, where well, it's gonna live besides Woodbury. If you want to have your own home, cars, and storage, we are currently working on setting up a small, safe settlement outside of Woodbury. Every one of our residents can move there if they wish. You can get one of the available plots of land right now. You know what? Let me have our guys take you to the settlement. Just head to the exit, and they'll meet you there. And if you have any questions about the land plot, you can ask me anytime. But I won't keep you any longer. Good luck. Nice. Feel free to reach out. Alright, so that dude said to come talk to him, though. Let's see. What he says again. Glad to see you. The bartender is listening. Today ain't too shabby, huh? Where do you get your food? Give me some advice. Just serve around outside. If you get hungry or thirsty while you're outside, you can still find food and drinks in stores, gas stations, and other similar places. And sometimes you might come across untouched sodas in some of the vending machines. But remember, nice. they may not always be on your side. 
and searching for supplies can take a lot of time. That's why I advise you to play it safe and stock up on provisions from me in advance. It'll be more reliable and survival will be easier without any unnecessary complications. Well, that's it. Good luck. What rumors, Scott? All right, listen up. You probably already know that Woodbury gets its electricity from the city. We just hooked it up. That's it. We don't pay a thing for it. Some even call it a miracle. So it's always made us wonder, how is that possible? Well, recently, our scouts measured where the highest concentration of electricity is in the city, and guess what? It turned out to be in the Asia Labs building. Yeah, pal. And we're still scratching our heads trying to make sense of it. The building itself is abandoned. No signs of life whatsoever. Either we've all been incredibly lucky, or there's something truly significant inside. So if you happen to find something there, let me know, all right? Everyone in Woodbury is eager to find out the truth. That's okay. I'll just sell stuff to. All right, nice. in paradise, ain't it? Let's make it count. Have a great day. Oh yeah, alright, let's go see uh, the settlement. Uh new we're playing pot B. Nothing is forever except change. Land plot. Welcome to your land plot. Here you can build your own house, upgrade it, as well as purchase furniture for it. Nice. Open build menu. B would be build menu. Have exit. Okay. Set up a tent. R. Build mode. Our catalog, little houses, forge it says 84 on those. Nice. Place furniture inside your tent. Oh, that I get my own little thing here. Nice. A uh, little cot. Oh, yeah, I can place it however I want. Fucking cool. Nice, nice. Place oak side table, so zero. Nice, nice. Radio. Have yeah, you put all this little stuff on here? Let's go. A lamp. Put a little lamp on here. Nice. Go back to Woodbury. Pretty cool though. Looks nice. You can come to your land plot whenever you want. By the way, Abby wanted you to Oh, you got a garage? Oh, damn, okay. Then you can do whatever your heart desires. Scroll through, so boom, boom, boom. So one nine, one two, one four. Five, eight, two. Yeah, okay. Oh yeah. Uh, Woodbury. Okay, G. I like that we have, like, uh, instead of a safe house, it's like, you know, you get your little safe, like, cabin. Little ranch. Go to Abby. What's that? Somebody's tablet right there, floating around. Seems like time literally heals in the case of SARS infected. You're back. It's great that Chris managed to call you here before you head into the city. And I saw your meager equipment and thought, 
You've just recovered from an injury. I can't let you go out like this. So I've asked Chris to let me give you a little financial aid from Woodbury. Ooh. In honor of your registration as a new resident. Oh, yeah. This is enough money to buy another weapon from Eddard, along with ammunition. And I suggest you put what's left in the storage, Boy, just in case. Oh, yeah. No need to thank me. The yeah, best thing you can do for us in return everything that's is to work with us to rebuild our community. All right, time to hustle. You should probably you already receive some casts from the Woodbury residents on the right, gotta get shit done. Don't forget to check them out. Real. And thanks in advance for your help. Just take care of yourself and come back alive. And the rest doesn't matter. All the time. Okay. All right, the first rule is cardio. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's great. So, do you want to open the storage room, or do you want to talk about something else? Well, not a bad day, huh? I'll leave. Nice, nice. What can I say? This is rolling. Plenty of air. It's nice and crisp. No sweat. Just a quick trip to the trader, and we're golden. All right. Oh, let's see. There's a gun. So guns right here. Oh boy. I don't need a bigger backpack today. I gotta say, today was a good day. Well, soldier, have you registered? Great. Let's do some trading. Or you can ask me anything you're interested in. Oh yeah. Trade. You don't have to worry about the quality of your goods. All right, so what do I got here? Oh, currency wise. Buy. Oh, you need that five times. Yeah, okay. Five charges. Oh, I see how much I have though. Uh, 60 slots it looks like go talk to Chris real quick Let's see see you buddy I need to talk to Chris she said something about not that way okay shot okay um let's see maybe Chris is the one that's gonna hook me up here So, now that you're registered, what would you like to talk to me about? What do you do as leader? How are things going? Tell me about land plots. Advice. I don't think it's a secret that being in good physical shape is crucial for survival. That's why we've set up a gym in Woodbury. The more often you work out here, the faster your maximum stamina will increase. Oh, nice. Position is the key to learning. Your body adapts to challenges and becomes better at handling them. For example, if you frequently carry a heavy backpack, over time you'll be able to carry even more items. Keep that in mind, and don't give up when things get tough. Another day in paradise, ain't it? Let's make it count. That's okay. I'll just sell stuff to the trader and it'll be fine. Feel free to reach out. Oh, let's see. So, get that. So H is your flashlight, L. L is your, uh, H is a flashlight, J is your tablet. Items of high importance. Resources keep people healthy. It would be great if you could provide us with some help. The fine plumbing kit, soldering kit, sealant. Uh, sort of good north. Be careful out there, my friend. I don't think I talked hey, to him. We haven't been properly introduced, have we? I might. I always have the rarest goods in the entire city for sale. I know you enjoy exploring the neighborhood, but if you need top notch gear without any hassle, feel free to come to me. What does he have? Let's see. Let's get down to business. Mm, okay. Oh, I see. So I have 25. Ah, okay. So you got 25 that you can spend here. Huh. Okay. Looking forward to seeing you again. Yeah, I thought I had money or something to buy from here. 
Hey there, want to buy some weapons? Tell me about your shop. Shelters in here. How can I earn a living here? Give me some advice. Back. Trade. Don't hesitate. Pick what you like. Hmm. Not enough coin. Hey, what does this thing say up here? We meet again. Find the required items for Woodbury. Okay. So. Alright, I think I go out now. Door leads the outside world, easy to go, raid, box. Alright, we're going outside, y'all. Hell yeah. Let me get the first look here, what it's like being outside. Her gun and everything. New Fortune City. Now you explore New Fortune City. It's surroundings in search of valuable items to sell. Make sure to bring enough supplies to avoid getting in a desperate situation. New Fortune City. Beware of the infected and other survivors who may possess a threat to you to prevent losing your items. Store the most valuable ones in storage or your protective case. All right. Once you have found enough valuable items, head to the evacuation points to return to Woodbury. Other players may be waiting for you there, so be careful. You have entered the danger zone. Collect as much valuable loot as possible and return to Woodbury. All right. We'll find out how smooth this plays here. What the f? Can't open those. Hope this plays a little smooth out here. Now what is that workbench? Hopefully, like I said, hopefully it looks a little smooth because uh, for me, gameplay wise, good. Just uh, OBS wise, it's like, ugh. Let's see here, we can go to settings finally. Game here. Take a look here. Um. On, apply. See what happens there. Screen mode windowed, monitor one. Audio, overall audio. Music volume will turn like half. Go down just a notch on these. Right, apply. Text English voice lines allow full data with this controls video a monitor windowed image scaling boost frame rates using GPU scaling and sharpening image scaling. Quality, go quality, balance. Let's see what that does here. Find out, try to find a smooth setting here. Uh, v sync, texture quality, fantastic. Go high, quality. Find out, we're gonna set it to high instead of fantastic because basically fantastic is going to be pretty much epic and I know that uh not a lot of people are probably going to be able to play that on epic 
but we'll see. See how it looks. Sometimes, sometimes for me, uh, running Epic is smoother than uh, High for some odd reason. I've searched this at all. Not entirely positive what all I can search or not sure. Find. Do we see the uh the marker anywhere though? That's what I'm wondering. Alright, so it looks like we're here. Okay. Find and require items for Woodbury. Workbench, player, evacuation, tasks. Can't zoom in or out at all. I'm aware of. Hmm. Oh, can you loot? Can't go in there. Even just the game, the gameplay is pretty smooth for the most part, but I mean, even for me, it's like I get a little, a little lag going through here. I'm trying to see where my little tasks are. Looks really nice though. Shit. Run. Damn, dude. They're fucking, uh, definitely. Get up on here. No, I can't jump up on there. Damn, I got 37 fucking rounds going out here. Thought we had some currency. She was talking about currency that I could buy uh, some stuff. Alright, let's take a look here at the map. Give me something for my bar. Oh, no, that's type. I don't want to type. So that's that. Journal. Ah, oh, okay. Here we go. Oh, okay, so you can. You can, uh... Scroll up and down. How do you move over, though? So you can scroll up and down. Fuck, dude. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm over here, and I gotta go... Fuck, dude. Alright. Got a ways to go. Hopefully this looks smooth for you guys, though. Because, uh, like I said, you know, it is, it is, it's, uh, it's a little rough. <laughs> That's to be expected, so loot, nothing in there to loot. All oh, can we loot? Can we loot all these? Loot the tr Holy shit, fucking A, man. Nothing? He didn't drop nothing? Damn, I like that. They have a little jump scare there. That's fucking cool. Figure out what all we can loot, though. The hitbox seems a little off. Can't loot that. A lot of fucking zombies and vehicles. I got such a long ways to go, man. Looks really good. Just uh definitely lag for sure. Oh, I'll be sick. Drive this bad boy right here. Can't get up on nothing though. Now let's see where we are. Okay, so that's the main road there. If I go to journal, track this. Yeah, I don't know why it doesn't. Uh, oh, okay, so WASD is how you move the map around. All right, so now I just gotta basically hit this road, follow all the way down to here. Okay. Nice, but I fucking found some ammo and shit. Road closed. Oh, it looks like you can loot these. Delivery service. Alright, so we got some pliers. Starting to find something. Maybe uh, some other people have already looted them. Maybe I'm not hitting the spot right on the uh, vehicles, on the stuff to loot. Trying to get an idea where all the uh, loot would be, you know? Nothing over here. I know, like, when Scum first came out, man, the uh, first, first times I ever recorded that, that game was so rough. Where is it? Ah, CPU fan. Wonder what exactly I'm using it for. Alright, so. Yep, got a little ways to go. A little thing here. Ah. Trying to get an idea which. Oh, there we go. Damn, nothing. Man. Loot is definitely scarce on these motherfuckers. Loot any of this shit? Oh, right here, okay. Nothing? Nothing on that one? Nothing on those? Okay. 
can't loot these. Probably just random and shit, but yeah, you can't go in those buildings. What about these crates? I feel like these would be lootable. Oh. Nice little campfire here. A little little barrel fire. Let's see, can I loot this at all? Ah. Ooh, got a sweater. That hold more though. Carrington jacket. I got a hoodie on now. A little wrench. Can you search both sides or is it just like one side of a vehicle? That's what I'm wondering. Nothing. Oh, this. Can you do anything with? Not sure if all the gunfire is from other players or if that's just me. You know. No, no, no. All right, cool. Oh, can I search both sides? Oh, a perfume. Probably just sellable. I Holy shit. Yeah, there's definitely a delay on that for sure. Fucking well, scares the shit out of me every time they pop up out of there. Keep forgetting that they can pop up out of there. Nothing. Just can't do anything. On the ones that uh, zombies come out of. Nothing in these trash piles? I really thought that I'd be able to. Uh... Ooh, tell me there's something good in here. Screwdriver. The spots for looting is a little rough, though. Damn. If y'all are seeing the lag, I was going to say, I see it too. But really hope to uh, see definitely, like I said, it's expected day one, but really hope to see uh, some fixes for that sh for sure. Oh, we got a nice little hard drive. I'm going to be able to build a PC here soon, y'all. you search any of this shit? Nah. Oh, nice. Got some good old stuff there. Oh. Hey, this truck gives me anything else good. Another jacket. Alright. Search this. No. A 
I've been staying away from these doors. <laughs> Got a bomber jacket, y'all. Nice, nice. I like that I can still look around while looting, so that is, that is nice. I don't like it when I'm looting something and I get stuck only in the one spot there. Okay. I've seen those dumpsters over there were like, you could look at them, but over here they're not. So what do we got here? Workbench. Oh no. Alright, so that's all. You can access workbenches while you're out here. That's fucking cool. Oh shit, I gotta pull my gun back out. I'll search and loot any of this. So I don't know if all that gunfire is just like... That's funny that it's all placed a little high. I don't know if that gunfire is other players or what. Coming along. Oh, we got a zombie. Holy fuck. Holy shit. Now. Got a fatal error, y'all. All right, y'all. Well, uh, I'll uh, try to record a little bit more, try to jump back in. But uh, yeah, I was going to say that gives you guys kind of a first look at the game so far. So those are some of the issues that I'm encountering. But uh, I'll try to jump back in, load into the game. I'm not entirely positive what server I was on, to be honest. So I'll have to look back and see. Because um, I'm assuming it probably saves your progress to that server itself. So I'm not entirely sure. But um, yeah, like I said, Mills Infinity or Life in Ruins, and I will see y'all on the next one.